my name is Sire from Science for Kids, and today we will be working on an experiment called Storm in a Bottle. For this experiment, you will need a glass halfway filled with water, a smaller cup with some water, a spoon, food coloring, and some shaving gum. You may also want to wear a pair of gloves like I am, just in case you get food coloring stained on your hands. To begin this experiment, start by taking your glass of water and filling up the glass with three-fourths way full of shaving foam. You want to make sure your shaving foam is evenly distributed. For the next part, put aside your glass of shaving foam and take your smaller glass. Open up your food coloring and put in three to four drops of food color. Now, take your spoon and stir it up. Once your solution is stirred, you're going to take your glass with the shaving foam and start slowly pouring some spoonfuls of water into the cup. When you start to see some of the food coloring come into the cup, that is when you've seen your thing precipitate and you're starting to see a storm form. However, if you want an even bigger storm, you can pour more water in. And as you can see, a bigger storm appears. So how does this experiment work? In this experiment, the glass of water acts as the current atmosphere and the shaving foam acts as clouds. Just like clouds, the shaving foam holds on the particles of water. However, when the cloud, or in this case, the shaving foam becomes too full, it precipitates. So as we can see, when the storm was formed, the water came through into the glass. For extra fun, try using varying amounts of shaving foam and water to see what kind of storms you can create in your glass. Thank you guys for watching, and I hope you learned something new about precipitation and clouds. Bye!